the image that I chose. Okay. It's a very important lesson in this song. So I hope we all come away with that. There was this guy on the plane. I was quite sure it was a douche. He was watching Green Lantern, doing lots of douchey things. He was yelling at the screen. He was like punching at the air. And the douchiest thing of all is that it's such a bad movie. <laughs> Conversation with the elderly couple in front of him. He seemed like a really nice guy. I felt bad about judging him as I opened the overhead bin. My baritone uke fell out and hit a woman on the head. And so I am the douche. Oh yeah, I am the douche. I thought he was the douche, but you know. In my slug satisfaction, my close-minded small reactions turns out I am the douche. Oh no, oh no. I stepped out into the street one very late night in Brooklyn, and a cab almost hit me. A girlfriend pulled me back. She yelled out at the cab, she threw the only object she had, which unfortunately was her wallet. <laughs> it got stuck on the back of the trunk. As we set off running, I expressed my annoyance. Why she have to throw her wallet? What was going through her mind? But later on, I realized she was just so angry and scared. She was trying to protect me, and I acted like a douche, and so I am the douche, oh yeah, I am the douche, uh, she was the douche in this instance, <laughs> my smug satisfaction, my close mind is all reaction to Seems awfully silly. After all, don't vaginas supposed to take care of themselves? <laughs> so douche as an insult, but seems pretty fitting to describe how it feels when you overthink it all to hell. Now I used to live in Brooklyn and I go to Williamsburg. I look at all the hipsters and I think, man, that guy is a douche. <laughs> it can be hard not to judge, but it's only ourselves we see reflected in others' choices. Turns out that the douche is me. small reactions turns out we are the douche oh no oh no something I constantly have to remind myself <laughs>